give any part of your life on the internet, there's a good chance that one of your email addresses or a password or some other bit of personal data will wind up where it's not supposed to. It's a sad and seemingly inevitable truth of a world in which we often choose to trade our data for convenience. So yeah, some of your logins are probably floating around out there and we can't have that. Well, specifically, Google can't have that. That's why earlier today, the search giant released Password Checker. It's a totally optional Chrome extension that, when installed, will warn you whether the username and password you just punched into a login form is known to be unsafe. If your password was part of a data breach, Password Checker will pop up a bright red warning to let you know it's time to pick a new one. Now that all sounds conceptually simple enough, but there's a very interesting cryptographic problem at the heart of all of this. Google has to make sure your password hasn't been part of some massive data dump without actually ever knowing what your password is. To do this, Google worked with cryptography experts at Stanford on an approach that should be plenty secure and scale nicely enough to sift through billions of stolen credentials. Long story short, when Google runs across a username and password combo that was compromised in a data breach, it stores a strongly hashed version of those credentials plus an anonymous hash prefix. Meanwhile, as you're just sort of poking around and logging into stuff around the internet, Google saves a hashed version of those credentials too with the same prefix. After a bit of backend wizardry involving private information retrieval, another layer of encryption, and then local decryption, Password Checker can finally and safely judge whether your login details have been available out there in plain text. Just remember this though, Password Checker isn't meant to catch everything. If you use really obvious insecure passwords, for example, like 123456, Password Checker won't nag you about it because that's my job. Honestly, what are you even doing, guys? It's 2019, please, please just use a secure password manager or something. Google says that it plans to continue refining Password Checker over the coming months, so it'll become compatible with more websites and it should get better at knowing where the username and password fields actually live on those pages. And for now at least, Google wants to keep Password Checker an optional part of the Chrome experience. Ultimately though, I think we all know where a feature like this really belongs, baked right into the heart of Chrome itself, ready to help the least security conscious among us make better decisions about their security online. Hey Google, let's make this happen. We'll see you tomorrow with more Engadget Today.